Hi, everyone. This is Mr. Leo speaking. And here I have a cereal box. Hmm. What is Mr. Leo doing with the cereal box, you might wonder? Well, I want to give you a couple of ideas of things you can do to teach your children using this cereal box. And I mean, you can... There are many more ideas, but I'm going to try to teach you a couple. And what you need for the first one is a pair of scissors and a box of cereal. I mean, just the box. You don't need the cereal, but you can eat the cereal. Anyhow, I'm going to cut the box. There we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and here we go. I've got a piece of the box. Now, what can I do with this? Well, the main idea for today's video is to make a puzzle. Rompecabezas in Spanish. We're going to make a puzzle, and we do this by simply cutting any image. It's better if it's uh, thick, you know, so it'll last longer, but we can take any image and cut it into several pieces. And then we can have our children put the pieces back together. And what the puzzle is doing is it's helping, it's helping the children, especially very young children, work those fine motor skills, but it's also working the brain in terms of the math, in terms of organizing objects on a plane, in terms of connecting and putting things together. So for these two reasons, um, this is an idea that of something you can do at home with things that you can find around the house that can help you teach your children while saving money. <laughs> so for younger children, you want to use less pieces and larger pieces. And as they get older and get better at building puzzles, you can have them, you can ha make the pieces smaller. And here we go. These are the pieces. And now we have a puzzle. Now we have a new toy for the children. So that's all for today. Thank you for watching. I wish you all well. Stay safe, stay healthy, and much love. Bye.